Hey guys, so today um, I'm going to talk about the DIY sanitizer box. Okay, as you all know, uh, there's a pandemic going on right now, so the coronavirus is everywhere, right? So we need to sanitize things before we bring them into our homes. But you can't always use sanitizing wipes or sprays or uh, whatever you have on things. For example, what if you want to sanitize? A fruit, some apples, right, um, or a box of donuts, or a library book, for example, right? You, can you wipe down the library book? No, you, you obviously you can ruin it. So what do we do? So here's a, a, a basically a plastic plastic tub. What I put in here is a very normal, easy to purchase uh, UV sanitizing light. Okay, this is used for aqu aquarium. So basically, this glass is shatterproof, and uh, this whole thing is submersible. So okay, it's not uh, afraid of water. And uh, this is an eleven watt um, aquarium sanitizing UV light. Uh, it's pretty easy to purchase on eBay or any aquarium store or pet store. You don't have to buy eleven watts here. It, uh, I, I believe they have anywhere from nine watts to fifteen or twenty something. Uh, any of these will do, right? These will definitely will work better, I, th I think, in my opinion, than those uh, sanitizing ones you see on the uh, online. Uh, they use batteries, and uh, I believe their UV power is pretty, pretty weak. And this is definitely a very strong sanitizing light. If you put one of these in a uh, tank of, of water uh, in the aquarium, over at night, it's going to kill all the fish, okay, um, or plants, whatever you have. Because th what this does, the UV light is, kills all the organic matters. I put this in my pool's uh, um, skimmer, and it killed all the algae, it even killed uh, some tree roots that's been getting into the, the skimmer. So it's very strong, uh, basically kills all organ organic matters, including germs, I believe. Of course, I'm not giving medical advice here. If you want to make sure it kills germs, you have to to uh, do some experiments, uh, use your, I guess, microscope or something to see. But based on experience, I would say UV lights definitely do kill germs, okay? And it doesn't t take long. You put it under the UV light for 30 seconds to a minute, it will kill all the germs on the surface. So what I have here in the box, it's three lights because I had I have three. You don't you definitely do not need three. This is one of these in a box will kill the germs. Okay, but since I have three, I put them in three different positions so that there's no dead spots inside the box. Okay, so one in the bottom, two on the different angles. But like I said, you don't you don't need three. So if you want to sanitize something, put that in the box. Why in the box? Why with the lid? Because, like I said, this light will kill all organic matters. And uh, as we all know, the uh, UV lights will cause skin cancer with long exposure. So do not look into the light. Do not expose your skin to the UV light for a very long time. So put it in there, close the lid, okay, and plug it in. So I'm going to plug this in on the other end, as you can see, well, you can see, let me turn off the light. Now you can see, you can see the light right even through the box. Okay, so it's, it's, it's working, I'm doing its thing. So basically when you have something like grocery bags, food, Anything that you cannot sanitize with a sanitizing wipe or hand sanitizer, this is the way to go. Uh, I don't believe this has any bad effects on fruits and vegetables because they expose to sunlight all the time, right? So only thing I can think of is plastic things because plastics tend to break down under long exposure of the sun. But... Um, I think that's okay. We're only exposing it for like a minute.
Anyway, so yeah, that's what I'm making um, a DIY box to deal with the pandemic. Okay, uh, thanks for watching.